Being a tremendous season's work that's just fallen at the penultimate hurdle, what are your thoughts on tonight? Yeah, it's hard to take. We're all really disappointed. I think we're more disappointed that we didn't really get to our level, I feel, the last two games. I think, you know, we had control tonight. I thought we started the game really well and, and looked dangerous. And then they get a free kick out of nowhere, a second phase set play, it's in the back of the net, it lifts them. It wobbled us a little bit and it took us a while to recover, but second half we, we came out and had the better of it again but just didn't penetrate well enough we didn't have enough cutting edge and that's really been the story of the season we haven't scored enough goals that's not down to the strikers that's down to the entire team um, look i've just said to them now i'm immensely proud of them I'm, I'm immensely proud of the fans they were absolutely brilliant tonight they've been brilliant all season and this club's moving in the right direction again we're we're proud of what we're doing, we're making progress. We know there's going to be huge expectation next season, but we want to live and rise to that. And, and now the hard work starts to be even better next season. So, yeah, as I said, we'll, we'll go again. Um, yeah, it just made me hungry for more and I wish we could start again tomorrow. Mm. But we'll take the summer to try and improve in all aspects of the football club. That's been our aim since I've been here and we'll continue to do that. The board have given me nothing but support and backing and that will continue again for next season. And we'll go on this journey again together. Um, I'm a firm believer in everything happens for a reason and perhaps you know this has happened for a reason and we'll go again next season. Just in terms of the game tonight, that spell just after half time where you barely let out there half a little spell. Yeah. Probably just needed to score at that point because you were right. Yeah, we did, top. but as I said, we it was our final pass, our final decision. We played around the outside too much and didn't really penetrate through. Um, when we got into the final third, our, our cross or our pass decision was wrong or execution was wrong. We just need to tighten up with those things. As I said, to be what we want to be is, is really difficult. You know, we can set a team up to be hard to beat. We can set a team up to be direct and, and play for set plays, but that's not what I want for us. I want us to be the best out of possession and the best in possession. And, and that takes time and it takes a process. Um, and we're not even close to scratching the surface along that process. Um, I want to get this club back where it belongs. I want to be the man to do it. I believe I'm the man to do it. And we'll work tirelessly hard with no stone left unturned for the entire summer to make sure next season we're there or thereabouts and, and improve again on this season. Yeah, it feels cruel when the season just finishes tonight, but it's been a season of real progress. You've put a, a trophy in the cabinet and, as you say, we've moved forward, we've finished in the top six, we've had a real good go in the platforms. Yeah, it there. has. Look, you know, we have to remember that Barnsley were in the Championship last season. We were in League Two two years ago. We're, we're making giant strides, but at the moment we're just not in, not getting there quickly enough. But as I said, that, there could be a, a purpose and a reason behind that. For us now, it's just about getting better. And I want us to be better. I know we can be better. I've seen flashes of it the last two games, but I still think there's loads more to come from this group. And we'll keep working hard to, to make sure that we hit the heights that our fan base deserve. And just lastly, we'll say goodbye to a couple of players tonight. The loan players have been terrific for us. Yeah. Every summer there will be changes in, in players personnel, of course, but everyone's done, yeah. done a great thing. Great things for us this season. Yeah, I've just thanked all of the lone players for their efforts, but uh, Connor and Traff in particular from, from day one have been an absolute pleasure and joy to work with. Um, we're sad to see them go, but that's the nature of football and it's the nature of football at our level. We're going to lose players all the time, some that will own, some that will loan, um, but it's about making sure we, we get the right ones in to, to improve us again. And you know, Like for like, you might not get another James Trafford or a Connor Bradley, but you might get a different type which can improve the team in different ways uh, and we'll work really hard myself chris the rest of the team to make sure that happens you know we've got loads of support from sharon the board uh, and that continues to increase and improve and we're going to do all we can to come back and, and make sure we're challenging not just the playoffs but the top two next season